Baltimore City Police found the body of a 75-year-old woman who had been missing for months. Versi Spell was a retiree and usher at Orioles games. Her family searched desperately for her after the 75-year-old went missing last October. Police confirmed today the human remains found in a storage container earlier this month in northwest Baltimore belong to Spell. As of tonight, no arrests have been made. And WJZ is live. Investigator Mike Helgren is at Spell's home with what else we're learning about this disturbing case. Mike. A terribly sad case, Denise and Vic. This home behind me was the last place where Spell was seen alive. And we've got a new statement from the Orioles. They're offering their heartfelt condolences to her loved ones. They say they will miss her warm welcomes to many fans at the ballpark. We smile with each other and, and uh, I feel she was a very sweet lady. Terry Lee is haunted by memories of her next door neighbor, Versi Spell. The 75 year old former federal employee and greeter at Camden Yards went missing from her home on Barrington Road in northwest Baltimore on October 19th. It's very uh, unhuman, it's very unreal. unreal her loved ones held a vigil just days later and prayed for her safe return. Mercy, stay strong. You know the Lord, and we're out here looking and praying for you. Just stay strong, and, and we're going to get you back. But two weeks ago, a heartbreaking discovery. Her body was found stuffed in a container sitting on the curb just a few blocks away along a busy stretch of Liberty Heights Avenue. I think it takes a lot of nerve. I, I, anytime when, when you're disabled or anybody again older it's like you know they're preying on people spell walked with a cane that along with her medicine and other personal belongings had been left behind unbelievable mm -hmm. you know you see it on television you hear it but when it's you it's a whole different story family members told wjz spell's apartment had been ransacked this crazy it's really crazy at the home today, I spoke to the nephew of the owner. He says his aunt was best friends with Spell and rented the apartment to her. She's a little broken up about it because how it happened, she didn't deserve nothing like that. He has no idea why anyone would want to hurt someone so vulnerable. It's incredible that somebody is like, wow, somebody would do something like this. I don't know what God rest her soul. And we spoke to that property manager through a ring camera here at the home. There are several cameras here at the house. We also reviewed the police dispatch recordings from when they found those remains. And officers said they had been at that location for some time. Reporting live in Northwest Baltimore, Mike Helgren, WJZ.